feel prepared, I feel ready, I feel, um, I feel in control, although I feel in control, but at the same time I know that what I'm waiting for is the first step on stage is going to be, I'm going to lose control there because the music does the job, you know. naked all the time, I'm burning inside, yeah. I, I'm, I think I'm naked all the time is how I felt <laughs> pretty much all the way through making the record. Um, because consciously I wanted to keep that state of, you know, not really knowing where I was going, where I was going with it. It's like some kind of renaissance kind of thing, you know, when you're born naked and, and vulnerable and fragile and and at the same time, she's the same person as we all know, Jenny Beth is, is fierce and full of confidence. Everything that she does, she really fucking means it. It's so sincere. The song that I heard and now the rest of the album I've heard is so sincere and intimate. So it's about kind of being as transparent and honest as possible on someone else's journey. The sense of being, you know, following an instinct. Um, in the past, I, I, I would do the opposite. So I wanted to change everything I had done before. If it was easy, you know, I, I think, yes, it's not easy to make a piece of work uh, like that. Even writing a book, or making a record, I think you, you, you're safe, but you always feel in danger. So it's, it's a battle to try to keep yourself um, stable mentally, physically, while you're completely feeling on edge, basically. <laughs> but that's the reason I wanted to do this record, because I, I wanted to um, offset myself, um, despite the comments and maybe the sometimes really, you know, good advice of good people trying to tell me you're making a mistake, you know, you're, you're taking a risk that this is not the time. But I was only following that inner voice, and sometimes that inner voice, people don't have that inner voice, so they, they don't hear what you're hearing or feeling what you're feeling, so they need a proof. Young voice forever, a kiss and a murder. We collaborated with a lot with Romy from the XX. She's a very dear friend of us. And she was the one saying, let it go. Just show, show a bit of who you are behind the whole Jenny Beth, you know, persona. It's a paradox because it's a solo album, but we actually collaborated more. There's a real transparency to our work. I think the thing about people like Jenny Beth or Nick Cave or Nadine Shah, people that hold a stage and hold a room in a way that's their own. You think when you meet them, it's going to be like, you worry about meeting them, because when you love someone's art so much, you just want it to be real. of relief when you meet them they're like they are just a behemoth in real life you know they're sitting in the bath and they're fucking smashing it do you know what i mean you don't have to worry about it and i think that's cool i, I believe i believed her before and now i know her i believe her 
and I will always believe that, which I think is nice. I think it's quite chaotic. <laughs> um, but with moments of rest. Uh, a lot of the record is asking the question of where is humanity? Where can you find it? And it's trying to describe human beings by pointing out the absence of it most of the time. I'm here to play music I've written with a bunch of people and I'm here to say something, you know, that I really took my time to think about. I think the achievement was to make it, so now everything that comes after is just bonus. I don't think of this record that's going to be defined in the next few months and that's it. This record's going to be here for a long time, so it... If it's not understood now, it will be later. I don't, you know what I mean? It doesn't frighten me. Of course, I want, like any artist, I want the most people to hear it and to recognize themselves in it and to share it with me because any connection is a great feeling and I think art it, it enables that connection. There's a place above where I like to go in my head. It's a place where I see others in their little ways. You know, people will still be able to listen to this record after I'm gone.